We begin this hour with young drivers, and if you have one in your house, you probably worry. They are inexperienced, but often overconfident. They tend to drive too fast, and they may be more likely to drive while impaired or use handheld devices at the wheel. Young drivers may deny it, but the research backs it up. For people between the ages of 19 and 25, car crashes are the number one preventable killer. Now there is a graphic new ICBC campaign targeting that age group to target itself. Hey, news reporter Andrew Johnson shows us how these new ads are hitting home at 6, and we warn you, it's graphic. <laughs> you little monkey. Mother and son spending an afternoon at the playground, laughing and learning. What kind of animal is that? But then mom gets a phone call, puts down her camera, isn't paying attention anymore. Hello? And within a few seconds, the terrible moment that can end a life and ruin many others. I could see how people might say it's kind of uh, sensationalizing the violence, but um, honestly, I mean, you can get facts and figures, but that's not going to make people change their mind. I, I think you need to see the actual, the actual effect of speeding. The short film is the work of UVic student Connor Gaston. He entered it into the 180 film contest, an idea by ICBC to convince young people to slow down, never text behind the wheel, or drive while impaired. There's a, a huge range in the film. Some are humorous, uh, some have great music, some are just really hard-hitting and direct. The level of filmmaking for the 19 to 25 year olds eligible to enter the contest is remarkable and three winners will be chosen to be part of ICBC safe driving campaigns. Do the short films actually stand any chance of changing behavior? We asked the experts, the people who are first on the scene of many accidents who watch tragedy unfold right in front of them. Nanaimo RCMP Constable Gary O'Brien is impressed. I believe that the videos will be effective. Um, the more hard hitting the video, the more impactful it is going to be on that audience. In these videos, they're showing innocent people being killed or, or maimed. And I think the youth, and that's the target we're looking at, probably 18 to 25, is th these are the people that really have to get the message. Connor Gaston knows he did. I know it sounds kind of cheesy, but I've, I've slowed down actually. I mean, especially in parks and school zones, I mean, uh, little kids can just uh, dart out of cars uh, out of nowhere. Or they could be sitting in the back seat. To watch the videos, there were more than 100 entered. Search 180 Film Contest on YouTube. Andrew Johnson, A News.